Dearest gentle reader, I find myself suddenly at a loss for words. The Netflix show Bridgerton alters details from the book series, including Francesca Bridgerton's sexuality. Francesca makes her debut in society during season three and meets many suitors, eventually getting married by the end of the season. However, her true love story will occur much later. The Netflix series changes Francesca's sexuality from the books, which surprises avid readers. In the Bridgerton books, Francesca weds John Sterling, similar to what happens in the Netflix series. Regrettably, two years following their marriage, John tragically passes away due to a sudden rupture of a brain aneurysm at their residence in Scotland, as documented in When He Was Wicked, the sixth installment of the Bridgerton series. Francesca, who experienced a miscarriage immediately after her husband's death, grieves for around four years before feeling prepared to enter into another marriage. Subsequently, Francesca returns to London and re-establishes contact with Michael, John's cousin, who she discovers has harbored deep affection for her ever since their initial encounter. Francesca eventually weds Michael, as their love story is extensively examined in the novels. According to the information available to readers, Francesca's sexual orientation in the books is portrayed as heterosexual, as she has only been involved with men. However, it appears that this will alter in season three of Netflix's Bridgerton. A multitude of individuals who had perused the book were astounded when they witnessed the introduction of John's cousin in the second part of the third season of Bridgerton. Contrary to expectations, John's cousin is not a guy named Michael but rather a woman named Michaela Sterling. Francesca is visibly surprised when she first encounters Michaela in the Netflix historical romance series. The writers have altered the gender of Michael's character, thereby affecting Francesca's sexual orientation from heterosexual in the books to maybe bisexual in the program. While season three only includes a brief interaction between Francesca and Michaela, the sequence clearly hints at the development of their relationship in upcoming episodes. Francesca is speechless when she encounters John's cousin, which deviates from the original book where Michael is the one who develops feelings for the Bridgerton sibling first. However, Michaela's inclusion in Bridgerton demonstrates the author's intention to incorporate LGBTQ plus characters and themes into the show. Francesca, along with the recently announced bisexual Benedict Bridgerton, has been selected as the series' LGBTQ plus representation. During an interview Jess Brownell, the showrunner of Bridgerton, justified the decision to alter Francesca's sexual orientation and to modify the gender of John's cousin. Brownell stated. I know for people who love the book when he was wicked, that for a lot of people Michael Sterling is one of their favorite characters. I understand that people are going to have feelings about the fact that this character won't appear exactly as they expected. But first of all, we are going to try to honor the themes of the book as much as possible. Obviously, some changes will have to be made to the storyline, but there are ways to honor a lot of the book. I would also just say that the book still stands. Michael Sterling still exists in book world. Whereas, queer audiences haven't gotten the chance to see themselves represented in a major way on the show, which is a show that is, in so many other ways, so inclusive. So I would just ask people to channel some empathy for those viewers and to understand the importance of us allowing those viewers to see themselves represented. Will Francesca end up with Michaela Sterling in Bridgerton? Francesca's journey in the Netflix program will inevitably deviate from Julia Quinn's novels, as Brownell previously said. Only time will reveal the outcome. Season 3 hints at an impending romantic relationship between Francesca and Michaela, maybe after the death of John. However, their union is expected to face challenges, including the possibility of not being able to marry. This is likely to be a significant aspect of their love story. Therefore, it is logical to assume that Bridgerton will partially adhere to Francesca's storyline in the books. However, instead of Francesca being paired with Michael, the character will be replaced with a gender-swapped counterpart named Michaela, 